So my folks, Kroiso and welcome to the walking video. And uh, you join me today here at Kittle here in the Gower Peninsula in Swansea in South Wales today on this very pleasant Wednesday morning. Well, in this video I'll be joining a walk down through Bishop's Valley and down to Pulte Bay today. What should be a good walk. Let's get going. Marvellous. Well, folks, now it's not time my first scrap of the day, my first piss off break of the day. And got me today. Pack of quavers. A couple of sausage rolls there. And a corned beef pasty. And uh, so far, I'm my walk, walk day down to, uh, from Bishop's Valley down to Pulte Bay today. As I've not been down Bishop's Valley for a couple of years now. I did this walk down to Pulte Bay a few years ago, as I said. And I did this, I did the walk to both the from Southgate uh, Pen outside only a few months ago. But uh, I've been trying to get out to do a walk the last few months. But the, but the weather's been absolutely atrocious. It's either cloudy, wind, rain, drizzle. But the weather now, the next two weeks now, should be a nice today. Uh, nice uh, Indian uh, sunshine. And uh, when we get down to both the bay a little bit later on, I will show the house where Father Tim Martin, my Celtic priest, uh, once lived as a youngster. And I leave a link to his YouTube channel in the video description of this video, so you go and check his uh, channel out, go and check his videos out. And uh, I also leave a link to his, about his video that he did for the uh, Swansea Archivial uh, records as well, so go and check that out. It's, be a, it's a very, very good read and a, a very good watch. And uh, on this walk also, there are a few things I saw for Ian Adams as well, so keep out watching for that. Right, what we do, I'm going to take him, going to take him a grab now. Once I've done that then, we pass on the walk day to day down, down to Pulte uh, Bay there. Get back to you later on now. Right behind me there you can see it's an ancient cave here at Bishop Valley. This is known as Gussel Hole Cave. And it goes on for five distance as you can probably see in the next shot. Well 
Well, I'll probably see a bit. And uh, for working for missing about this cave, anything about the cave in the video description of this video. I know Ian Anglis likes this cave, but I'll see what we did today. Ian! You in Ian? Ian! No, I can't be able to call me back. The next shop now I show up mine. It looks like this, that. Yep, and uh, here's the mine. And uh, in Bishop's Valley. I'm not sure what this is called. It's on the screen right now, along with its uh, great reference coordinates. And I hope this is of interest for everyone, and uh, Ian Adams especially. And I'll have a more surprise for him later on in the video. So, uh, on we go. In the blessed stream, come to the water, Christ Shotgun to me, it's all good. It is, yeah, but it's too. It's a big double barrel, 16 double barrel shotgun. Yeah? It weighs an absolute ton. It's a little bit wonder. Have a look, oh, a load of two as well. Well, let's give it as far as it's and see what it does. Here it goes. Oh, that's a fun that was. We're gonna kick that right. I'm gonna put this gun back in the same spot until the next time. There we go. There we go. This is a ride now onto uh, Pofty Valley here, Bishopston on the Gower Peninsula in Swansea on this fantastic Wednesday afternoon. Oh, it's amazing to be here today. Every down the area, do visit. And uh, last year, as I said uh, today when I had my lunch, back a few months ago and I did this walk from the uh, Southgate side, but today I did it from uh, Bishopston Valley. 
side of the day. And uh, would be expecting to see Father Tim Martin today. My vicar, I'm a Celtic priest, and uh, no doubt playing his whistles and his, uh, and his days we do there. Because you see him, but just swap my mouth off with his dreadlocks. <laughs> and uh, I will show the house he lived in as a small uh, lad, and very due course. But uh, I'm going to sit here now a little while longer, enjoying the lovely surroundings, and then uh, show you around the, the area. Before we get away, then down onto Pothy Beach, just out of us there, and show you a few shots there, and then and even there. Then, so get back to bed now. Now then, these two white houses here on Pofty uh, Valley here are very important. The one on the right is where Father Tim Arden used to live when, when he was a young kid. And uh, you can blame him on such a, in such a fantastic spot like this. Right, okay, now right on to uh, Pofty Bay here. Let's show you a few shots of the lovely waters here, so of this wonderful beach here. i get back to you then, and I'll bring you on the end of the video. Well folks, thank you for joining my video and walk, walking from the wonderful Bishop's Valley and down to the very picturesque Pothy Bay here in the Gower Peninsula in Swansea in South Wales on a very pleasant Wednesday afternoon. Have a fantastic day today, so it's out of the day. Hope you'll be back again soon to do another one for this, for this fantastic location. Meanwhile, for Missy Adams, just check this out. There's always time for one of these. Oh yes, there's always time for this is going to be and a cave of mine and a geocache all in my video. Can't be bad, eh? Right, good. Now I'm going to leave a shot now to the left hand side of the, of the water's edge of the lovely Puffy Bay here. But far on that then, I'll see you back somewhere for scoff number two. So who knows where I end up. I hope you enjoyed the video today, folks. And thanks for watching. And I'll speak to you soon. Tag Nevitt.
Right, the second scoff of the day is brought to you today from the Roma Fish Bar in Penclove. Just stand by and check this out. Just check this out, folks. Go a fish and chips after a good old long day's walk in. Just what I need. Bloody, bloody great this. And a can of Diet Coke as well. Well, that was fan dabby doozy and uh, compliments to the shaft and well done to Liam and Tom Francis, the owners of Roma Fish Bar in Penclough. That was top draw there.